A slinky will only stretch when there is a force being applied. You can test this for yourself. You cannot stretch the slinky without a force. This is something important to note as it will make the following experiment much easier to understand. When we have a bottle with water and it's connected to the earth, we can experience weight and buoyancy, which are effects of a force or motion. For example, something that's more dense or heavier than the water by volume, like the slinky, will sink or appear to go down. And something that's less dense, like the ping pong ball, will get pushed to the top or float. If I glue the ping pong ball to the top of the slinky so it can be one unit, we can experience a density gradient. The more dense material at the bottom and the less dense at the top. Also, the fact that the slinky is being stretched shows that there is a force present when connected to the earth. However, as soon as I release the bottle into free fall, the buoyant force of the ping pong ball and the weight of the slinky completely vanish along with the density gradient. The slinky is no longer at the bottom and the ping pong ball is no longer at the top. Also, the fact that the slinky is not being stretched shows that there's no force present. Acceleration requires a force. No force in free fall equals no acceleration in free fall.